Hi there, Del with the Spark here again. Today I'm at a job where I think it's to install some light fittings. So I'll get in there, hopefully film it and let you see. Thanks for watching. So what, what is it? What do you want doing? So, the urgent two things. Okay. One is, uh, well this is not urgent, it's just annoying. Um, this lamp, this, this, yeah. this branch here. Has oh. It's been a bit dodgy. Oh, that one. There's something wrong there, yeah? yeah? So, switch it on, let's have a look. All right, this one doesn't work. Yeah, that one, that one doesn't work. No, it uh, could be the lamp older yeah, is yeah. dodgy. Exactly. So if you do need that, you'd have to get a lamp older. Right. Anyway, we'll, 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 we'll have a look at that first. Yeah, okay. Okay, and what else? I think, um, and then, yeah, the really urgent one is the bathroom light. So we've got a torch. All right, okay. But so it's basically this, it's like stuck in the down position. Okay, cool. I mean, it's supposed to activate the fan, which is not going to work for some time. Yeah, well, because it's not. Oh, you know what? Did you, did you say this to me? Yeah. Because I'm not sure I've got a pause switch on the van. But obviously, it's not. I can get one, but yeah. it's not a big deal. But, um, okay, cool. So that's the main thing. That's the main thing. The thing that we, yeah. Okay, then. See, with that, with that fitting, what I can do is just take it down, have a look at the lamp holder. Mm. I suspect it could be damaged, it could be dodgy. Yeah. And then the other thing. Oh, yeah, okay. Here, like the two way switch to downstairs. Yeah. It'd be nice to have three and be able to put the downstairs one off because at the moment. Oh, so. This one does this one and this one does upstairs. But nothing does downstairs, whereas downstairs you can switch on upstairs. So presumably there's a way to put a two way switch because there's already wiring, isn't there? When you're downstairs, you can switch this light on. Right. But when you're upstairs, you can't switch that light off. Should I show you? Okay. Yeah, so we can switch that light on upstairs. Yeah. But when you're upstairs, you can't switch this light off, which is a bit annoying. You can't switch it off? It would be nice to be able to switch it off from upstairs, because otherwise you have to switch it off down here and then go upstairs. And... Well, the thing is, if there's wiring in place and they haven't connected to it properly, yeah. then you can do that. If there isn't, then you have to get a wire upstairs. Okay. What does this one do? So this one does down, downstairs. And then when you go downstairs, can you, you can switch? Can do it upstairs, yeah. So, so you that can, all works. Right. I suspect they've just uh. done that one to do this one. Mm. It's not good thinking, because if you're coming downstairs, you'd want to switch this light on, yeah. wouldn't you? Yeah, yeah. All right, so this one, the two-way works, so you can switch upstairs on, yeah. and you can go up there and switch it off. You can go up and switch it off upstairs. And you can switch it on from here. Yeah. But this one here, it switches this one, but there's no other position yeah. for you to switch it off. Yeah. Right. That's All right, so this one. Yeah. Switches downstairs. downstairs. And you can go downstairs and switch it off as well. Yes. This one switches this one from here, and you and can go downstairs. downstairs with, yeah. But it doesn't switch off from upstairs. Yeah. What they should have done is put an intermediate, yeah. in, two-way intermediate, but obviously at the time they didn't think yeah. about that so what i'm saying is if the wiring wiring is in place which i doubt and yeah. they haven't wired it properly and they haven't connected it properly then it can be changed but if the wiring is not in place wire yeah you'd have to get a wire up there to do it which i suspect is not because upstairs you've got a two gang switch if this was to be switched from upstairs you'd have a three gang yeah. switch as well no, exactly all right, then let me just go and see if I've got a pull switch, yeah? Mm -hmm. So you want that socket down there changed to a double, yeah? Yeah, please. I mean, there's one on the other side of the wall. Do you want it in the wall or... Because if you want that changed to a double, you have to take out that box and cut a hole in the wall yeah. to put the... Or do you want it sitting on the wall? Like, you see how, you see this one? Yeah. You see that there? That's sitting on the wall. sitting in the wall, really. I mean, yeah? All right, so that one... You yeah, changed yeah. to a double, what else? Um, so there's a couple upstairs as well, which ideally could be changed. Changed to doubles. a double, well. okay. So luckily I did have a pull switch. It's got no string, but once I get this one down, I can uh, change it. Yeah, this happens a lot with these. This must be a cheap, cheap um, pull switch. There's the old fuse board there. Just need to switch the power off. I don't want to bring the steps all the way downstairs because I'm right at the top of the house to switch that light enough. I'm doing it live. It's not recommended. Always isolate. Make it more mechanically sound. Uh oh. Okay, look.
This is still alive, so we've got to be careful. There you go, lights are on, so it's working. Don't work live, always isolate. There you go, it's working. I got a feeling this is what they, I reckon this is going to break though, because look, see, it's quite thin, eventually it's going to break. The only thing is, Beatrix, is um, you see, see that there? Oh yeah. I reckon that's going to break eventually. Yeah, well. But if it does, if it does break, don't need to call out an electrician. No. You just get a new one, push yeah. it. This stays in place. Yeah. You get get a new one, push it through yeah, there, get a one as well. and just put a knot on it, and that will come through. That's all you have to yeah. do. So you want this one changed uh -huh. to a double, yeah? Okay. On the opposite side of the wall, okay. there's another one. It's rubbish, but um, that one there, yeah. yeah. Okay yeah, then. Be useful to have a double. Okay, cool. I'll get one with the USB. So that one's all done. New USB connected. Just go next door, try the other one. That's it all done, that one. It's the last one. Just got to put a test on it now, everything will be good. So that one's 0.44. Catching up with me. Right. Right, 0.44 is the highest reading. So I'm going to take out that lamp holder, see if I can get a new one, because I think that's what's causing the problem. So that's how I've left it there in those connectors. It's going to be tricky to fit it because those cables are really short if I can get a new one. Should be able to. Oh well that's all completed apart from that light. I'm going to go to that lighting shop. I'm sh they've got all those types of bits so I'll pick that up. But it's going to, it's not easy to fit that lamp holder because the wires are, cables are really short and I don't want to take the fitting down or anything so hopefully I'll get it and um, be able to fit it quite, fit it easily. The rest of the stuff went quite well, so no problems. Anyway, see you next time. Hi there, Delroy the Spark here again. I'm back on the job where I had the 41 of these. Uh, I bought a new thing. I had to buy the old thing. The rest of it's in the back of the van, sorry. And I'm going to take out the new, part, new one of these and put it in. So let's go and see how it goes, okay? That's the culprit there. So I've switched it off. Yep, it's off. So let's see what I can do. Let's see, I don't even know if that's in. see that hopefully well that went easy um hope those connections are okay because i don't really like when i can't see my connections to test them properly you know but anyway it's working client seems satisfied hope it hope it lasts <laughs> okay thanks for watching bye